Hey, today's August 1st. Tonight, with the assistance of Queen Anne, is in the semifinals. 9 o'clock. It's not too late. If you'd like to go, you can buy a ticket. If you can't afford a ticket, call me and I will, I will get you a ticket. I would love your support tonight. We have a great chance to win. The show did extremely well on Friday. We got nothing but praise. And I would like it to talk about a little bit of the process, excuse me, in video journal number 20. And, and the process is, as a writer, first, very tedious and inspiring and, and very difficult. However, to see my work come alive is the most incredible, rewarding feeling one can imagine. And also, my confidence as a writer has really improved. I know that the words are, are fine and good, and, and they kind of flow in an incredible way and, and inspire the audience. As an actor on second hand, I'm, you know, I'm learning. I had given up the craft many years ago, and I've been working in schools for four years. Frankly, you don't need to be Laurence Olivier to do um, outreach theater. I do fine. I do great character work. I know I can, make, I can keep students standing on the edge, clapping and laughing the entire time. But can I do a serious role like David Belkin? Well, I can. In rehearsals, I did it. And the, the director was very pleased with my work. However, once I got on stage, I guess I wouldn't call it stage fright, but I would call it a little uncomfortable feeling was preventing me, the lines from flowing. And there were pauses and my emotion wasn't coming out as a result. Acting needs to be comfortability with the lines and just allow the emotions to come out. And that happens in rehearsal, but it didn't happen last on Friday in stage. But it, we worked on it all weekend, so hopefully it's going to be better. Anyway, please come to my show. So this is Video Journal 19 talking about the process. Orlando Bloom, an incredible young actor, struggled to learn, but his process was incredible. His process was inspiring to watch, and I know that a lot of my friends voted for him. Some of them even voted for him and not for me, and that's okay. I expect my friends to vote for who they think is the best, and hopefully they will vote for me because they think I'm the best, but if they don't, it's fine, and I am very grateful. Anyway, at this point, I'm going to sign out, Video Journal 20. God bless. If you can make it tonight, please come. Bye.